In this tutorial, I will show you how after fitting your data, you can find new x or new y values from the fit curve. This feature is available for both linear as well as nonlinear regression. Let's begin by fitting this linear data. To do that, I make the graph active and select Analysis Fitting Linear Fit. The input data has automatically been assigned as the active data plot. I'm going to go ahead and leave the default settings in the dialog. I just simply need to enable the Find X, Find Y feature here by clicking these checkboxes. Click OK to perform the fit. There are additional sheets added to the workbook, one for Find X from Y, as well as one from Finding Y from X. I can simply enter in a Y value here, and the associated X value will be calculated. You can enter multiple values, and we can do the same thing, enter an X, and have the associated Y value calculated. Let's go ahead and look at another example. Here we have some Gaussian data. To fit this, again I'm going to start from the graph, and then select Analysis Fitting Nonlinear Curve Fit. In the dialog that opens, I need to choose a function, so I select Gauss as my function. Then data for data selection, notice the input data is again automatically assigned as the active data plot. If I want to use this fit curve as a standard curve to calculate unknown values, then again, I simply turn on this feature here. Now in this case, for finding x from a given y, there's going to be two results. So I need to say two columns. And let's go ahead and just calculate find x from y. So I click on fit, I get my results, and the last sheet in the book allows me to enter in a particular value here for y. Let's enter a value of 15, and then both x values are calculated and output for me. Let's look at one last example. We have some sigmoidal data here. Let's go ahead and fit this again from the graph. We do have a sigmoidal fit option. It opens up the same fitter, but to this growth sigmoidal category. So I will choose dose response. Data selection, I want to specify multiple inputs. I want all the plots in the active page. And then I want to fit all those points together and give me just one fit curve. Turn on the feature here. Actually, I'm not going to turn it on um, for now. Just to show you, you can enable that at any point. So let's go ahead and hit fit. We get our fit, let's take a look at the graph here, expand our parameter table. So in the case of this function, we have three derived parameters, EC20, EC50, and EC80. But again, if you want to use this fit curve as your standard curve to calculate unknowns, you can always click on the green lock, bring you back into the dialog by selecting change parameters and enable it. Let's find X from Y. You click Fit to automatically update, rerun the analysis, and then it will enable, you go back to the book, and we will see the Fit Sigmoidal Find X from Y worksheet. Let's again tile these here. So let's enter in a Y value of 40 and have it calculate for us the X value, our dose in this case. This concludes this tutorial. Thank you for watching.